the entrance video showed that Roan Express. It's a way to get from uh, Lyon Airport down to the centre. There doesn't really seem to be any other way. A good tip is to buy your tickets online, mainly because it's like 20 euros. There was a guy on the train who actually had to pay about 18 euros for a single ticket from the airport to the centre. That's just crazy. So definitely buy those tickets online. We've arrived at our apartment, part hotel. We actually got an upgrade, which is awesome. Huge room, cooking facilities. It's like a dream. We're gonna head now to Fort of the Air. It's Sunday here in Lyon, so there's not a lot open. Um, so we're gonna head up there on the funicular. takes like about two minutes to walk from the main uh, metro station the, like the funicular station so it's not too bad beautiful people you could actually hold in this arena but it is amazing it's huge i reckon you could probably get a good couple of thousand people in here the setting's beautiful you can see the whole city behind me You've got to come here when you come to leon so we're going to go back to the apartment we're going to uh, go to a restaurant later there's a famous chef in this town unfortunately he's no longer with us called paul bacuse it's one of his restaurants not the actual restaurant that's just really expensive but this place is quite well priced it does the same sort of food and it's open tonight more importantly so we're gonna head there and uh, taste some real uh, well get our first taste of uh, proper leonese cuisine can't wait Okay, we're back from the restaurant Paul Bocuse, um, well not the actual restaurant, it was a brasserie um, associated with the Bocuse restaurant group, a place called La Marguerite. It was a really good place to eat, especially on a Sunday in Lyon where like virtually nowhere is open. They gave us a choice when we arrived to either sit outside on the terrace or inside in the dining room. We chose to sit in the dining room because it's so beautiful, like on the pictures it just looked amazing.
But quite a few of the people in there, um, a mixture of locals and tourists, a lot of people were going for the set menu, which is three courses for a set price. You can have any dessert off the a la carte menu as well, which is a huge bonus. We also chose a bottle of Bordeaux red wine, uh, 29 euros I believe it came to, which is a really good price. The half bottles tend to be around 15 euros, um, so way less than you'd pay in the flagship restaurant of Paul Bacuse in the north of Lyon. So to start, we had the Caesar salad. Um, really well done salad, quite a large portion as well. Um, Leon's famous for its kind of stick to your ribs food, so we kind of expected there would be a bit larger portions than normal. Great chicken, um, anchovies instead of bacon, which some people might not like, but it went really well. So onto the mains, we went for like a veal chop, um, served with uh, fondant potatoes, or as it turned out to be crispy potatoes. Um, also served with uh, courgettes, tomatoes, kind of like a ratatouille but in a towel. It was quite a unique how, the way they did it. Um, the flavour though from the tomatoes and the ratatouille and everything was just unlike any I've ever had before. I was really impressed with it. Uh, the veal chop as well, perfectly cooked. Huge portion of veal as well. Um, you really do get fed here, it's fair to say. The other main course was a sea bass dish with um, polenta chips and like, um, it was like a puree of um, parsley and garlic. Also parmesan was in there. Um, whatever was in there was just amazing. It was a light puree, went perfectly with the fish. The fish was perfectly cooked as well. Amazing, really, really good. So for the dessert course, they bought over a whole bottle of Havana rum for the rum baba. This is one of my favorite desserts and I have it every time I come to France. The baba rum is basically like a sponge cake and they just serve it simply with whipped cream. You pour your rum over the top and just get stuck in. It's so good. So I had the chocolate cake, which is like a big bar of chocolate with a crispy base, um, some whipped cream and a little bit of praline on as well, along with the custard served on the base. Really good flavour again, very rich, um, but you kind of expect that when you come to a restaurant like this. It's very similar to Le Gavroche in London, um, in the way they serve the food and the style of food. The Rue brothers are actually from this region of France originally, um, so you can kind of see the influence um, on Le Gavroche's food from where it began here in Lyon. To check out the vlogging space that I've got here, it's, I couldn't have got it any more perfect. Nice sofa, natural lighting coming in just from that side, open plan kitchen, we've got bathroom facilities, a lovely sized bedroom, really good air conditioning as well, because um, it's quite hot at the moment in Lyon, it's about 30 degrees I think it's going to be today. Yesterday it was about mid 20s, so it is getting toasty. So we've got loads more planned for the week. I really can't wait to experience more of Leon. We've only been here half a day and we've done so much already. Um, so with that in mind, um, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And don't forget you can follow me on social media, Twitter, Pinterest, Instagram, Facebook. And I will see you on the next video. Thank you. Bye.